Hi, this is Julia Waldorf with JuliaWaldorf.com, and I have Aaron down here with Coastal Vacation Rentals. And Aaron, what is what do you do? You do short-term rentals, and what is short-term rentals? Short-term rentals, the vacation rentals, really are those defined by less than 30 days, and they create a bed tax. Okay, so it's people who come into town, and they rent a house or a condo in a vacation area for one or two nights. Or a week or two weeks, less than 30 days. Okay, all right. So, so and that's what you specialize in? Yes, we do. Okay, what did you talk about at the MLS this morning? I spoke about what was going on both with the city of Pismo Beach and with the county, and, mm -hmm. and specifically with the county, the areas in Avila Beach mm -hmm. and Oceano, because we're here uh -huh. in South County and those are the areas we manage. Uh -huh. And in the city of Pismo Beach, they passed um, a, a modification to the zoning ordinance and uh -huh. a new municipal code last year. It was not approved by the Coastal Commission, mm -hmm. so the zoning ordinance will not change. Uh -huh. But the municipal code will, in fact, be enforced, and that's the, they're creating the forms and so forth, so that you have to get a license, pay a hundred dollars, uh -huh. and and you have to meet certain parameters, and 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 you have to have a manager and somebody to contact, and, mm -hmm. and it has to be posted. So, so that's all going into. They're getting stricter with the short-term rentals, then. They just want to be in in a control situation where where nothing gets out of control and there's no one to contact right on the spot and and they want to make sure that out of town owners have somebody local uh -huh. that can be contacted immediately in case something happens Anything. in the short term, some big wild party or fire or something like Anything, that. Anything you bet. Okay, yeah, okay. Well, um, so they're getting stricter. So if you're going to invest in short-term rental or an investment property as a short-term rental in each individual area in the Central Coast here, you have to check with the county to see what the rules are, don't you? Well, you have to check either with the city or with the county. Now, the mm -hmm. county is just uh, has been working for a year or so on putting together a, um, an ordinance and, and a change to their zoning ordinance. Mm -hmm. But it got it got set back for a while. Now they've brought it back to the table, uh -huh. and it's going before the planning commission. Uh -huh. And it has very specific, different um, parameters for up in Cayucas, for uh -huh. Avila, and in Oceano that uh -huh. are exclusive to that area. Yeah. yeah you know, they're saying so, that it will create okay. some more, but not really. The okay. reality is, in many areas, it's going to be restricted to. Uh, like in Avila, you can uh -huh. only have a unit 50 feet away from the property line. You have to go 50 feet before you can have another one. Yeah. Well, I don't know how that's going to go. No, yeah. I don't either. I think it's unrealistic. <laughs> we'll see how that'll go. But, and it's not passed yet. But no, it's just it, going before they're trying to, So Hopefully that'll get shot down because that doesn't even make any sense. That's not common sense um, regulations. I but, have a hard time believing the Coastal Commission will approve uh, that type of a situation in the visitor serving area. I, yeah. I would, they didn't approve it in Pismo, and I don't think they'll approve it there. So yeah. we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. It's a we'll see thing. So, okay, well, so yeah, you check with the city and the counties. Make sure before you, you're making a short short-term vacation rental investment you have to make sure you can what you can do in that area absolutely so, yeah or okay. you can call our office and I'll give you some insights right where to head and what is your contact information Aaron my name is Aaron down and you can contact me at Aaron down at mm. charter.net or call me at 805-540-8485 and I'll be happy to help you out okay well thank you so much thank have you have a great day okay, ciao ciao bye-bye <laughs>